Hello, and in this lesson, we are going to learn how to insert a few basic formulas in Word. So you can see here that I have a very simple table. It's a quotation. So the first row is the product name, and then the second is price, and the third row is quantity. Now, what I really want to do is to multiply price times quantity to get a subtotal for each row, and then do a grand total, which is the sum of all the subtotal at the end. Alright, so let's learn how this can be done. Now first, go to Layout, and in the Data tab, click on the Formula button. Alright, now we want price time quantity, so let's replace some with product instead. And here you can see that the default is left. Now, what formulas follows positional arguments? So we refer to the cell that we want to perform calculation as left, right, above or below. So unlike Excel where we refer to rows as B1, B2, B3, B4, then in Word, um, everything is a bit simplified. So let's click OK. And 100 multiplied by 3 is 300. Yep, it looks good. Now for the second row, again, we don't want some above, we want product left. Because basically it is the same argument as the row above it. Let's copy the formula and then click OK. Now for the next row, let's paste the formula that we copy. All right. And then for the final row, where we need to do a total, then go to formula. And here we'll keep it as it is. Uh, the grand total is basically the sum of all the subtotal cells above it. So click OK and we are done.